first of all, you claim that I'm not talking to these people who go around calling themselves Hispanics. No, I think that's mostly social justice warriors. I do talk to Cubans, Colombians, Dominicans, and Puerto Ricans. And the idea that they do not see themselves as Cubans, Dominicans, Puerto Ricans, Mexicans, and so on is absurd. My argument is not that um, suddenly all of these groups are going to vote for Donald Trump. It's that you are not helping them. Um, you claim you're speaking for them, but in fact, you're speaking for yourself as the overlord of, of more, the more and more cheap labor coming in, coming in, coming in. Um, the vote isn't going to go, I think um, Donald Trump will get the same percentage of the Hispanic vote that, oh, that's right, every Republican always gets. It's 30 percent. It doesn't matter if you're George Bush, John McCain, Mitt Romney, Jan Brewer, it's about 30 percent. Now you'll have all of the um, the people who don't think of themselves as Colombians, Mexicans, Cubans, but Hispanics, La Raza, La Raza founded by white people, by the way, um, um, with money from the Ford Foundation. Um, they'll be ginning up the social justice warriors, so you may not get more of the Hispanic vote. I think Donald Trump absolutely gets more of the African-American vote. <laughs> and if only I could make bets with all of you. I'd make a lot of money. Not more than Obama, or um, not more than Hillary, more than any Republican since Richard Nixon. Yeah. He's going to do very well with the African American vote for a Republican. 